And that is that. Ladies and gentlemen, this video is now in session. Obi-Wan 362, Gamer at Law presiding. And welcome back to more Persona 5. Last time, we secured our infiltration route to the treasure. We fused a Seth with high counter. And now, we wait. Oh, excuse me. We send the con card. Back when the con card is out. Failure is not an option. Left to do, Joker? Make sure we take our time going forward. Take our time going forward. That would be a first. But. We've done it. Uh. Finally managed to deliver it. We finally made it. All that remains is to actually send the calling card. Looks like we'll manage to get out before that investigation starts going down, too. Still don't know anything about the true culprit behind the mental shutdowns, though. I wonder if we'll learn anything from Nijima's son's shadow. I doubt she has ascertained any relevant clues. I agree. That's why she is the warrant out on the Phantom Thieves, after all. Furthermore, the public believes arresting us will solve the case. Public prosecutors won't stop now. They have the weight of the general public on their shoulders. If only we knew who the true culprit was, we wouldn't have to fight Nijima-san's shadow. Who could it be? Do you think it's someone we know? Oh. Oh, Haru. Yes, I do. That's a possibility! True, but there would be no end to the mistrust we began doubting our peers. I'm not saying we'd doubt all of our peers, just one! Just the new guy! Either way, we only have one opportunity to turn the tables. This final calling card shall be my magnum opus. Simply let us know when you're ready, Akira. Oh, I will. You got to say, Soji. Yeah. Okay, just what you've been saying. Um, alright, so, so far the game's like, ah, you can't do anything. But I'm gonna get a massage. So we can be prepared to go and do stuff. <laughs> well, does it feel good? <laughs> Pretty well built, despite your looks. Guess your clothes make you seem thinner. Master! Should do it! Oh. And move. Yeah! See you later. Thank you, Kawakami. So good of you to give me a hand. I just realized how that sounded, considering the circumstances. Um, okay, Kawakami was the only one here. Hifumi's of... Oh my gosh. There's nobody available! Okay, that's... A little awkward. Huh. Um. Hmm. Nice. Okay. Well. Currently. Since nobody, nobody's available to up. Which means we can focus on either finishing guts up or finishing kindness up. I think we do kindness. That's what I say we focus on. And so, I need to go and hit up Chehea up on the north side. And then after I give Kawakami to make us some stuff. What do you want to do? Actually, never mind the curry. The curry is good and all, but it's not coffee. Hey. The coffee yep. right now sure does, is much more beneficial Hi. than the curry. So I'll have Kawakami make coffee until we can up Sojuro enough to make the curry more worthwhile. Who? What, are, what, are, what else to do? See, this one include Ryuji? How are people hanging out with Ryuji right now? Whatever. Um. Okay. I can't. I always can't out with Hifumi, Soji, Kawakami. Chehea didn't show up either, but she's maxed out anyway. So I'm not too concerned about any of that. But. Uh. 
yeah. I'm gonna go get it so we can get our kindness double buffed, and then we'll go from there. So give me a second. Ha uh ha! -huh. A new book that makes video games easier. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. It's time for more Train of Life. Let's see if we can do any better. Hmm. Up is the intermediate course. Awesome. We're starting off well. We have a good amount of money too. Okay. Great. The yeah, course is looking pretty simple. Oh. Wait. Something rising up out of the ground. Is that a gate? You can't pass through. Snap! 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 I'm the alligator who watches over this gate. Hence, why they call me Alligator! Oh, dear goodness. Give me a number to open the gate. I'll give you three chances. Snap. These weirdos were so unlucky. So the numbers that open this lock are three, five, seven, and nine. Snap. Well, two has to make sure they add up to one of these, those, those. Snap. Three chances. Okay. Six. Oh. Seven. Do 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 do. You, you're impressive, Snap. I'll let you through. Snap. Whoa. Gate's opening. Head onward to the goal. Oh yeah. Hey. It's finish line, first place. What a battle. Paws are all sweaty. Your paws are sweaty. Anything I feel. <gasps> do we do it? Yeah! Angelic kindness, ladies and gentlemen. Angelic kindness. Now we can go and we can continue on with our social link. All right. It's yeah. amazing. It's gonna get late. Set to sleep soon. Can I just get another massage from Kawakami and do it that way? That seems better. Kawakami, can you bring me my coffee and read me a story? Oh, sorry. Hi. And Master Coffee. Thank you. Thank you, Becky. Oh, jeez. Alright. We're still dropping in popularity? How are people... How are people not just over it already? Like, look. We've done enough. Um... Shinya's available. Okay. So, it was brought to my attention that if... I don't call a meeting, then for some reason, nice. I can't up with anybody. Which is a little dumb. Mainly because it doesn't tell you. Oh, thanks, Soji. Uh, mainly because it doesn't give you any indication that that's the case. And so, if you ask me, that's problematic. But. Okay. Me up with the others. I guess it's because they anticipate you trying to send the calling card. All right. Good. Now send the calling card. Mm. So when you want to send it, the earlier the better, right? Hold on. No. My opinion, we should wait until right before the time limit. How do you? Why? I'm asking your reasoning behind that idea. I was thinking. Saison is a realist. Mm. Even if she believes the fan of these exist, do you think she knows how they steal hearts? Could that be? Furthermore, there's a chance she expects that she herself will be a targeted. Okay. Um. So because her heart is ready for any possibility, the calling card might not have enough effect. That doesn't. That doesn't make sense. Hmm. I only yes. saw that. Say it theoretically, but I believe so. That doesn't make any sense. Because at that point, it would be regardless of when we send the card. If it's not going to have an effect, it won't have the effect. So, when we send it would be irrelevant, unless you're, unless you're proposing more build-up before then. Well, so it would be prudent for us to wait until we are driven into a corner to act. How about this? What? 
we do so with no time to spare, I assume even Saison would have to be somewhat agitated. Okay. I don't know. I don't... Nah. You're right. Hmm. Sharing the treasure actually appears. It sounds quite logical. Does it? Does it really? The notion that, oh, well, she probably figures she's going to be targeted by the Phantom Thieves, so it's not an issue. I don't think science works that way. I agree. Press of a catchy coon. Though it's a bit vexing that you know more about my sister than I do. <laughs> it's only because of my work as a detective. That means. Now, now then, if our time limit is November 20th, which is two days before my birthday, we act the day after sending the call, and we act the day after sending the calling card. Shall we send it out on the 18th? Okay. To prepare as much as we can before then. Well, then. well, can't complain about having more time. Make sure you're ready, everyone. I can. All right. So. Uh. Uh, I want to see. I want to see who's available. Who is available? Futaba. We can't because obvious reasons. Shinya's available, and both Makoto and Haru are available. So we're gonna go hang out with them. Um. Let's see. Makoto Haru. It's, it's gotta be Haru. She's far. She's far too far behind for us not to hang out with her. We need to get her caught up. Do I have an empress? No, I have two priestesses. So. Okay, we will hang out with Haru. Let me go grab a magic persona and we'll go see her. Oh my gosh. That's a sheep from Catherine. Oh my gosh! They knew they knew what they were doing. They knew what they were doing with this character design. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay, so somebody claimed, somebody on the internet claimed that the crane game was a timing effect. It was a, it was a timing game, really. And if you hit X at just the right time, you would, you could get the prize. I'm not sure if that's true, but it might be. You're supposed to hit it right as it, as the claws grab the doll. So, try it out. Let me know if it works for you or not. But anyway. Alright, Haru. Le I forgot to grab a persona. Oh, son of a... Alright, once more with feeling. Haru? Shall we chat? Just wait till the day. I'll be taking care of plants till then. You think in the meantime? I'm here for the vegetables! <laughs> so you happy? We're at harvest on the sixth. That's right. Okay. In that case, I came to see you! Thank you! Aw, you're welcome, Haru. Vegetables are in the planters are doing well. I could show them to you if you'd like. I would like. And we will grow stronger together. And so I would like to hang out with Haru. Thank you. So you'll take a look? Thank you, it really helps. Okay, cat, fine. You want to go for a walk? You don't want to hang out with Haru, member of our team. <laughs> so is quite a mysterious thing. Within its gentle care, even a tiny seed can awaken, spread its roots, and grow up towards the sun. It's almost like a mother. Perhaps that aspect is why I find this place so comforting. Aww. Haru. Why guess say it like that? To be honest. You know, I only started taking care of these planters because one of my teachers asked me to. I was hesitant at first, but I liked it so much that I kept kept them long past the original request. 
Aw. Started mixing my own fertilizer, adjusting soil ratios. Now I raise these plants in complete secret. Well, that's interesting. But, um, Kirikun, I'm worried what the school might do if they found out about this. Why? You're just making plants. Uh... It'll, it'll be okay. <laughs> so dependable. I, I try, but I literally just gave you an assurance with no ba basis for that whatsoever. In that case, we can be partners in crime. You got it. Let's see, Kirikun, I really enjoy the time we spend together. I do too, Haru. You're so cute. It's so different from how I feel when I'm around him. Who's him? Sorry, my fiancé. Oh, that piece of garbage. It reminds me, though, I wanted to ask your advice about him. I think he's a piece of garbage. This whole arrangement began when my father first introduced us around the beginning of this year. I was told we were just meeting his friend for dinner. But then he said that friend was to be my fiancé. <laughs> it was surprising, but I suppose I had always known I would someday be married off for political gain. Man, what kind of life is that? What kind of horrible setup is that? To know, well, one day my father will marry me off so he can gain some favor in the political realm. Like, screw your dad. Sorry. But no, really. So I accepted, and that was the start of our relationship. Poor Haru. <laughs> but, uh, but, um, no relationship stuff happened, just to be clear. Oh, <gasps> you're so cute when you're being horrified by the thought of being mistaken. You know, whatever. Anyway, I was never exactly fond of him to begin with, but now he's grown. Now he has grown far worse. Recently, he's been suggesting we go on an early honeymoon together to celebrate our coming marriage. But you're not getting married anymore. Can't even stand to look at him though. Let alone spend any actual prolonged time together. So, um, what can I say to decline his offer? <laughs> I'm afraid of flying. We should break up. Hmm. About that. Um. As you know, my father passed away before he could fulfill his promise to rescind the marriage proposal. Uh-huh. So any conversation about putting a halt to the marriage will have to come from me. Yeah, you can do it, Haru. Tell the truth, I've already mentioned it to my fiance. Oh! He refuses to listen to a single word I have to say. Well, he's a piece of garbage. Apparently, he's even been telling the employees at Okumura Foods about the contract he made with my father. Now, the company would have to pay extreme reparations if it got called off for any reason. That. Ooh, yeah. I'm not sure that. Huh. I just don't know how to handle this. I can postpone while I'm still in high school, but after that? We'll, we'll, we've got you, Haru. We've got you. Think about it now. It seems my father's death has turned out to be quite favorable for my fiance. Yeah, no kidding. Oh, well, he's now engaged to the majority shareholder of a massive company. Yeah. I suppose in the end, all he really cares about is his own personal gain. Yeah, there's a lot of people like that in this game. I'm noticing. That's not what a relationship is supposed to be built on. It should be something more. Something like a love so intense that just seeing the other person makes your chest tighten up. Do you know anything about that, Haru? I'm not so sure. Have um have you ever experienced that? Uh Gosh, how Gosh, how do I answer that? Too many times to count, Haru. Every time I see you. I have. Really? Okay, that one worked. That's so romantic. I'm actually a little jealous of you and of the girl. Oh! But there's no spark like that with my fiance. Spending time with him is almost like some kind of training. You're training your heart. On. Pr could probably use some of that too. Still, any hardship I go through now will surely help the Phantom Thieves eventually. I'll get through this. I know you will. You're so earnest in your resolve, Haru. You're so good. You're so much better than all of us. 
<laughs> Sorry. Oh, it's getting late. I should probably get back to my gardening. Oh, here. I can help. Well, I think I'll be staying here a little while longer. Goodbye. Bye, Haru. So... I needed kindness... For somebody's company exec. Again, ever since Akuma, there have been so many. Fianthes are going way too far. Uh, they're getting carried away by their popularity? We're not popular anymore. We're infamous. Please, can we do anything about this? What can they do? I needed kindness for somebody's social link. I can't remember who now. Uh, you're back. I think I actually think it was Soji. I actually think it was Sojiro. I said that, and then as soon as I saw him, I'm like, wait a minute. Yeah, because I was like, oh, I gotta do I gotta do Sojiro's social link. And then was like, oh, I can't do Sojiro's social link. And I was sad. And it was a thing that happened. Um, alright, let's see here. So Haru is now three. Four, I get celeb talk. Okay. So far, she's doing wonderfully on the stuff we're getting out of her. Uh, Sojiro still needs two more, three more, excuse me. So yeah, I gotta get him to nine for curry tips. To make curry potentially worth it again. On Akechi's just a giant pile of poo. Uh, gosh. So, we currently have an issue. Currently have an issue that needs handled. I don't know how we want to handle it. If I focus down uh, some of the people who are closer to being to those higher ranks, like Sodro, like Makoto, like On, all these people who are closer to higher ranks, uh, we might be able to get a few more people to go to Mementos with. Because right now it's like, I need to go to Mementos. That's the only way that I'm going to be able to finish up Hifumi's so confidant. That's the only way I'm going to be able to get farther in Futaba's confidant. Like, I need... I need us to go to Mementos. But I don't know when. And so, I'm gonna pass that question off to you guys. When do you think we should be heading to Mementos? And is there anything else you think we should prepare to do before then? Anybody else we should get to Mementos position before then? There's a third million yen bounty on the fam thieves. How would you use all that money? Probably relax some luxury resort. Start my own business with the rest of the money. Wait, no time for this. It's our strategy for the clients that we're meeting tomorrow. Ugh, <sighs> back to lame old reality. Thank you, the curry was delicious. I would also like to know how to make delicious curry. I'm just gonna throw that out there. Um, I might I don't think I actually have a hero font persona right now. So I already Place an order. Okay, apparently I've not actually placed an order yet. Cause I didn't have enough I didn't have enough uh money. I asked you guys last time about stuff to get, and I don't know what to get. Cause I get I can get the rolling metal now. But that would be all my money. So we won't. Also, look at my shelf. It's complete. Uh, anyway. I don't believe I have a persona for... I do not. So give me a second. I'm going to go fetch a persona to hang out with Soji. And then we'll be back to hang out with him. Soja have returned! Should do with that man. Ugh, my head hurts. So, seems concerned about Tava's uncle. See if my nose into Soja was Tava's problem? Blah, 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 blah. Should be able to help him with my current level of kindness. Hmm? Look, you have something to say. I do, and Barith will help me grow stronger with you. Closer, whatever. Let's help him out. All right, then. Well, I guess there's no point worrying. Help me clean up. I'd be happy to. So I'm actually delighted to help. Futaba! Mm -hmm. 
Chaba, what's wrong? It's not like you'd come here this late. <laughs> Look, Sojuro. Uncle's bank info, transaction history, credit details. Got tons of dirt on him. How'd you get your hands on this stuff? Don't worry about it. Also, her shorts are awful short. I'm just gonna throw that out there. Hacking, of course. Uncle's in loads of debt. I never want to suit against us now that we have all this data. <clears throat> this is a criminal offense, you idiot. There's no way we'd be able to use this stuff in court. But... Jeez. I've known all along how badly in debt he is. He's not going to try and take custody back, so don't go doing stupid crap like this, okay? Aw. It's so drill. I did it because of all that stuff he said to you. Aw, poor Futaba. About that. I've been thinking. Push came to shove. I wasn't there to help you. Sojuro! No! Stop it! So, you know, maybe there's somewhere better for you out there. No! S somewhere better? No! Futaba! He doesn't mean that! He feels bad, and that's what it is! Sojuro, stop! Am I not supposed to be here? Am I just in the way? No! Futaba! You are perfectly fine right where you are! <sighs> No, that's not it. You don't want me either, Sojuro? No, Fuja! <laughs> don't do this! Can't take it! It's not what I meant. I just think it might be better for your own sake. Fine! I still have Akira and Mona and all the others. You just stay here and play with your stupid coffee beans. F Futaba, no! Oh, gosh. I've got a roommate now. She likes you guys way more than she likes me. Makes sense, though. You're the ones who saved her, after all. But, dude, that's not... Where'd I go wrong? Oh, you did try to care for Futaba. You did! You did You did. A, you did the best you could! If it wasn't for our supernatural ability to go into people's cognition, like, that's the only way, reason we were able to save her. But that got me... Th I told myself she was the reason I kept making Wakaba's curry here. But deep down, I think that was just an excuse to stay distant. At the end of the day, the coffee and the curry people love so much are both just... excuses. C they're... they're still delicious! Ah, gosh dang! because I spent more time in this cafe than I ever did trying to talk to Pratava. I'm going to go out for a smoke. Try to cool off a bit. Sorry to lay this on you, but can you go after Futaba for me? You should go after Futaba. Okay. Hey, Futaba. Kira? You want to talk? Yeah, thanks. You know, Mom used to talk about Sojuro tons when I was little. <gasps> how good he was at making curry, how interesting he was to talk to. I remember everything. I remember how she smiled when she talked about him. <gasps> oh, Mom really likes Sojuro. Oh! I said some real mean stuff tonight. It's not his fault Mom's incident happened. It's not his fault I shut myself away from the world. Because of me, Sojuro lost a crap ton of money. Just thought I'd be able to stay here with him if my hacking worked. You should, you should tell him that. You should totally just tell him that. Yeah, you're right. Jabba, um, can I come in? It's my room. It's my loft. Mm-hmm. Welcome. Sotaro, I... Look, I'm sorry about what I said just now. And well, if it's okay with you, I want you to stay here forever. Up here in my loft. Forever? I know it might be more fun living with people your age like Akira. But I'll do my best to see things from your perspective. So, will you stay with me? Technically, you told her to stay here, which is in my loft. Uh. <laughs> Is that supposed to be some kind of proposal? Oh, my word. 
Hey! Quit your laughing. <laughs> You're as exhausting as ever. I love these two. They're fantastic. It's just... Mwah! Ugh! Hey, Sojo. I know I've caused you a lot of trouble, but I really do want to be here. Aww! So, let's keep living together. Futaba? Sorry for not saying that sooner. Oh, and thanks for taking in someone as horrible as me. You're not horrible! Oh, Sure I'm gonna... F oh, yeah, of course you wouldn't want anyone else! Oh, <laughs> I can't deal with you two! You're too cute! <laughs> no hesitation. Don't come complain to me if you regret it. Actually, I'm not gonna let you regret it. Oh, If you ever need help, just tell me. Might not be graceful, but I'll be there to protect you. And you can stay with me for as long as you'd like. Forever if you want. Uh, mm -hmm, I will. Forever. <laughs> I'm going to keep sort of living with you too, Akira. Yeah, basically, right? Everybody's pants pee all the time. Ah! It's time for the live stream. The director's going to be on this week. I'm out of here. Bye! The director... What? Such a fool. My whole life I've taken the easy way out, of, out to avoid these kinds of conflicts. I didn't stand up for Wakaba when I knew something was off. I didn't stand up for you either. Whoop. Instead, I went on and on about how you can't fight back against the laws of our society. Oh, but we are. How you should just accept the hand you're dealt in life. Those were, more, were mere excuses I made to keep myself in line. Gave me the easy way out I wanted so badly. Maybe instead of all that coffee crap, I should have been teaching you not to make the same mistakes I did. Coffee's pretty good, though. I go rant again, but I feel like I managed to put a lot behind me today. Thanks. Thanks for making me realize what's really important in life. I do try, though I failed miserably at connecting with you on a deeper, more personal level. All right. Which is terribly annoying. I'm going home. All right, better head home too. Stay up too late, okay? I want you to. I don't want you oversleeping. You got it. Oh look, my kindness went up. Boy, I, it's a shame I'm already angelic. All we need is All right. guts. Not really concerned about guts right now, but guts. Also, can we talk about the insulting nature of that? In order to do that rank with Sojuro, you have to have max kindness. But you get kindness for doing it. That's just mean. Game is just mean. <gasps> Haru! Good morning, Akira-kun. Mona-chan. Phantom thieves are all over the newspaper and television. Where well, is not wait. Huh. I, uh, never mind. Outlaws now. At the point where uh, blah, 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 I can't talk. I'm sorry. We're at the point we can send a calling card, but it makes me anxious to sit around and wait. How about you, Akira Kun? Uh, it makes me antsy too. Yes. Ah, so we're the same. Pauses like these make me think a lot of, about a lot of things, even more so since we can't afford to fail. So we're sending the card on the 18th. It's a ways away, but I'd like to spend these days wisely. Oh, we will. Be hanging out, chilling, relaxing all cool, shooting some b-ball outside the school. Um. Oh, no. Great. This country's been getting dangerous, and peace been our only redeeming feature. Fanthe should target somewhere bigger, more global, not this tiny island country. Like, oh, I don't know, the casino city of Las Vegas or something. Huh? <laughs> Casinos! <laughs> it was like a dream when I went there. <laughs> Might not look it, but I'm good at card games. Their four suits of cards all symbolize something. By the way, Mr. Caruso, look at this. Oh, crap. How about you? Clubs is a club. Diamonds is a gem, spades is a sword, so it is hearts. Oh, garbage. Just... <laughs> the Holy Grail. Nailed it! Again, I'm not super concerned anymore about cheating, considering I've already maxed out my knowledge. And even if I could get charm from it, I've already maxed that out. The only thing I wouldn't max out is guts. So, the Holy Grail! That was my this guess, though. Excellent. 
Uh, what I'll probably do is I will, de in order to do this, I'll declare what my choice is first, and then I'll look at the network so that you can see whether or not I actually thought it was the answer or not. Uh, and I don't have to just say, oh, I bet it was this. So, Sean has a cup. Interesting. Uh, they say the suits all represent classes of people. The rulers of the Holy Grail are clergymen. Okay. However, there are no cards that belong. There are cards that belong to no class. In other words, they have no suit. Okay. Really? Huh. Nice going. I know. I'm a genius, and that's why I'm an erudite. The only card without a suit is the Joker. Some theorize, some some theorize good. Some theories say it originates from the full in tarot decks, but no one knows where it really came from. Oh, I saw a thing on this. Oh gosh, I think it was actually it was added. I don't know where they actually got it from. However, both the trump cards can bring about unexpected effects. How you use them is critical. Yeah. You heard her, Joker. Pretty good name, if I do say so myself. I kind of wish I'd give myself a cooler name. Yeah, why are you named Mona anyway? Whatever. Uh, I think what I saw was uh, Euchre was the game that added the... is what caused Jokers to be added to uh, standard playing card decks. I think that's what I read. I could be wrong. Let's give it a try. Oh, why is this here? It's a joke. I don't want to see it. Straight up terrorist logo. Okay. Crusoe is dangerous after all. Dude, why is he trying this? Brave or just an idiot? He's a tourist. He's got guts. Yep, I got guts. I wonder how many times I could do that and keep getting guts. Maybe I can... Maybe I can do it. Maybe I can do it tomorrow. Maybe I can do it. I wonder. I wonder how often I could do that. They made us a stinky pile of poop. No. No. Okay. It's actually been a while since we hung out with On, and I would really like to get her social or comp, whatever. Move uh, a little closer to done, especially because it's pretty up there. On it's at seven. Uh. Yosuke messaged me and Shinya messaged me. Yosuke is at six, and so he's technically one behind, but on we've also had since the beginning, so it's a little ridiculous that she's only at seven right now. So I really think we should get her up now. We'll worry about the others later. Send car, just lay low until then. Hey, you know how I said I was going to try to take the world by storm with my modeling? Oh, I was thinking of getting in shape first. Better to help with that than Ryuji, right? He said he'd be glad to train with me. How about you, Akira? You want to join us? I have Narcissus. Yeah, let's let's hang out with Lady On. Oh, Lady On. Thanks. All right, let's go. Work up a sweat. It's pretty close by. Oh, no, Ryuji. No, I mean you don't have to. It could just be the two of us. I'm the one that trained him, actually. <laughs> me and Akira have actually already been to this gym. I wonder if you have to... I wonder if you... No, because he, he introduces you... Does he introduce you here part of the story? Or is it in the, the confidant with him? Because then you have to do that one first. Interesting. It's pretty sweet, huh? Not too many people getting in your way. Anyways, uh, what are you trying to do here? Yes! want to slim down. On, oh, you're already pretty slim. Uh -uh. Try jogging? Aerobics alone aren't enough. I'm gonna tone up too, so I need to start lifting weights. Oh gosh. Plus, my shoulders are drooping. I make my biceps leaner, and I need to straighten my back out. Okay, you know you're pretty, right? Obviously, I wanna cut down on my waist size too, and firm up my butt and calves. Okay. Uh, look, you're, 
You're beautiful as is. Maybe, but even natural beauties have room to improve. Come on, natural beauties? Oh, you're talking about yourself. <laughs> okay. Gosh. If, if on, if, if on was Chie, the last one, you'd have got punched in the face. Just gonna throw that out there. Anyways, motivation's good and all. She's not gonna be able to move tomorrow if you do all that. Aww. And you come up with a training regimen for me. Uh, you're such a pain. <laughs> if you do that for me, I'll go on a date with you as a reward. Oh, F that. She's super cute. What's wrong with you? You're not gonna do any better, Ryuji. You're definitely not doing any better than on. When thinking you're some sexy character in an anime, it's sad watching you like this. I mean, seriously? She kinda is. This is kind of an anime, and she's fairly attractive. What's your problem? No way, man. First off, them sexy characters have never come to the gym in their PE uniform. How am I supposed to know that? I've never even been to the gym before today, which is amazing. Also, stop peeing your pants. Oh, it's my agency. Hi? Oh yes, definitely. Even a smaller article would be great. Huh? It fell through. Yeah. Uh, I guess that's okay. Mm-hmm. Aw, we're on. <sighs> supposed to be in two magazines the month after next, but apparently one canceled on me. It was a black and white shoot, so they said I wouldn't stand out. What? Okay. Sound like fun though. It's about the every life of models. So you just gotta find somewhere you do stand out then. Huh. There has to be somewhere my vibrant charm will shine, right? Uh, there's no doubt in my mind. Yeah. Awesome! This is working. Uh, where? Shh, Ryuji. Hey, speaking of magazines, there was a really pretty girl in that one you said you were starring in. She's got this innocent vibe, but she's sexy too. That's what real charm looks like to me. Were there photos of me too? Oh, Ryuji? Uh, yeah. And does she have long brown hair? Oh, Ryuji? Yep, that's the one. You know her? You gotta introduce me, dude. Okay. All the girls you could have been talking about just had to be Mika. Ugh, I'm so pissed. On, on, please breathe. It's okay. Come on, which machine are we using first? I'm gonna break it. Uh, on, don't. Three of us trained until we had reached our limits. <laughs> My body hurts. For some reason, I feel satisfied. That's what working hard feels like. Not bad, huh? Yeah. Yeah, that was actually pretty fun. I think it was better than. I think it was because the two of you were here with me. I had to prove I was working extra hard. <laughs> Simple stuff like that, though. I help you keep pushing. You're so dumb, Ryuji. Good advice. Should have thought of that. Is that a competition? I mean, it's a little bit. How come yours is also peeing, but it sounds different? Do we not have different sounds for different? Whatever. Mom forgot to buy stuff for dinner, so I got. Guess I gotta head home now. See you guys. Bye, Ryuji. Ryuji just can't say no when his mom needs help, huh? I mean, that's the nice thing to, to do. I'm actually a little jealous of the relationship they have. Aw. I mean, even growing up, my parents were super busy. They always told me I was strong, that I'd be fine on my own. I was free, but I was lonely. We're on. We make friends, but we moved a lot. And every time, I start all over again. She got used to the loneliness. Aw, that all changed when I once I met Shio. The world seemed so hopeful. And then she jumped off a building. I heard her rehab is going well. She's going to be officially transferring to school soon too. Aw. Hey. I need to show her that I'm working hard. 
that she doesn't need to worry so much about me. Oh. I'm sure she already knows. Yeah. Right? There we go. Right? She needs to see how much I've learned from her. This is a strong resolve from on. I finally did it. I finally did it. This time, this meeting with her. All of those. All of those were three music notes. All right. Let's get back. Let's head home. I have trouble moving though. My legs are killing me. Yeah, well, Bye. made us all work till we couldn't work no more. So it's kind of how that happens. But goodness. Uh, Hi. Lucy, I'm home! Uh... Mission was almost over. Why did it end up like this? Well, you know, I like to screw things over for everybody involved. Um, let's see here. Kawakami's available. Oya's available. Mishima's available. And... Aren't we... Aren't we about done with Mishima? Does he have, like, one or two left? Mishima has two left. So, I think we're going to hang out with him next time. I realize, again, I realize we, we're putting Oya off. And it's because she's just the lowest of my priorities at the moment. But, we're almost to the point where she's going to start being our only option on some nights. The only other problem is, I have video games to play. Uh, but I'll probably worry more about them when I do New Game Plus because it's a little late to try and clear all the video games, you know? So, anyway, uh, I think that's going to actually do it for this video. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for watching this. I hope you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed this video, then by all means, do feel free to hit the like button. And of course, if you dislike this video, for whatever reason, the dislike button is right there. Before we go, let's take a quick look. Haru, next one is Celeb Talk. So, you know, allows for a retry. Negotiations fail. Um, Soji's still there. Almost that protect with on, which would be great. Great to have. It would be great to have somebody else who can protect me, not just... Ryuji. Uh, he is still a horrible piece of garbage person. Uh, Futaba, we're two away, but we need to go to Mementos to advance any more with her before we can do emergency shift. Fortune Teller's maxed. Twin Wardens are maxed. Da -da -da -da. Weapons Dealer is at four. We'll get a discount on the next one, but I'm only so concerned. Stocks maxed. Kawakami maxed. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Gamer. Ammo pouch would be helpful, uh, but we're going to focus... We're going to focus... Because we're nearing... Um, we're nearing what everybody in the... All of the playable characters think is... Going to be their last palace... And because right before we get arrested, uh, we're going to be focusing heavily on uh, our party members. So we will go with Shinya anytime we can't go with our party. That said, anytime we can go with our party, that's who we're going to go with. So just to throw that out there. Wrong way. Uh, Hifumi. Gosh, this, okay, we need to go to Mementos. Because we have her also who's being blocked by that. Mishima's fine. We'll probably do him next time. She is maxed. Prosecutor's still sitting at six. And Prison Master. And Morgana. So. It's. Hmm. The, the, the focus going forward will be Haru. Uh, because she's so much lower ranked than everybody else, until we get her to about like six or something, 
she's going to be focused more heavily than the others. Uh, after that, it's on then Yosuke, then Makoto, then Haru. And Futaba's in there somewhere, too. Uh, just because because of the order that we got them. But so, again, I passed the question off to you guys. When should we head to Mementos? Because Mementos is going to be super important. We need it for two? We need it for two of our people currently. Oh, not what I wanted. We need it for at least two of the people that we have to take care of. For, excuse me, for two of the confidence we have. So we really need to handle it so we can get that stuff taken care of and we can advance those confidants some more. On the other hand, if we get a couple more confidants to where we're right there and we can just... Because like presumably for Sojuro, we're going to have to go and change Futaba's uncle's heart. Which would be great. Uh, and I thought we were going to have to do that with On. I thought we were going to have to change um, Mika's heart. We might not. On might just suck it up. Uh, Makoto, we might have to change um, What's Her Face's boyfriend's heart. Haru, if we don't have to change the fiance's heart, I'll be shocked. But so, like, there's so many, there's so many people that, like, hearts need changing. And, like, that's the gimmick, and it's fine, it's great. But so I'm just kind of sitting here wondering, like, okay, do we do we go now or do we put it off? Do we go now or do we put it off? So let me know what you think we should do in the comments down below. Uh, but again, that does it for this video. Thank you all for watching this. I greatly appreciate it. And until next time, ladies and gentlemen, this video is adjourned.